lucky and I married into a family that loves food just like I do and loves to get together and so we are going to go to a cider pressing party where everybody gets to bring their own apples along with my sister-in-law and her family they bought 800 pounds of apples tree in the background it does not have any more apples on it it is all there we harvested it all right so we did a bunch of harvesting today of apples and pears even um, so these apples I will bring them over to make some cider at my sister-in-law's these are the littler ones and then these ones are bigger ones now, they are going to make some cider, but a majority of the apples that they have are for hard cider, which is awesome because it's like, that is one of my favorite kinds of beers is hard apple cider or hard pear cider. So since I do not have all the equipment to make hard cider for myself, we are just going to make apple cider for my family because my family loves juice and fresh ingredients are always great too plus I get rid of my small little apples that is hard to kind of work with also going to make some hard cider but he is making a pear apple hard cider So unfortunately, um, cider only lasts about a week before it gets kind of sour. Um, so when you press cider, you can have to drink it in that week or you can freeze it. Thank you guys so much for joining me at the cider pressing party. It was a lot of fun. I was able to get two gallons out of all the apples that I brought. And I was able to use up my small little apples that's kind of hard to really work with anyway. So let's give it a try. Oh, so good, so fresh. No sugar added. Lipstick stain. <laughs> So what do you guys like to do with your family? Do you guys get to do anything fun? Any cider pressing parties or anything else? Let me know in the comments below. Talk to you guys later. Bye!